walkie-talkie in case they Sorry. try that way. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. Here, you can have some too. I think we should look for your parents. They always stay in the same place when they go there. The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! You All I gotta say is this Walking Dead playthrough is unique to anything we I've gotta seen. Go! <laughs> yeah, why? Clementine? Clementine! Smoking on that band pack, oh. dude. Clementine's gone. Wherever she is, I have to find her. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Who's with me? We'll look for Clementine together. Hell yeah. What kind of friend would I be if I wasn't there for you now? I do want to see like the Ben only, the Ben only runners. Like I want to know what happened to them. I'm bit. Clementine is gone. The pedophile jigsaw guy stole her. And I do have a, yeah, Ben had like six kills. Like he is so OP. I let Ben go after he Bernie, demanded I let him get go. Get out here. There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt. But it's not Vernon as we know. Clementine, are, are you all right? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch. Holy. Who is this? It's a pedophile. Vernon, that's what you're thinking. A pedophile. You really watch your tone. Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. What do you want from me? Whatever it is, I'll do it. You can let her go. Whimsical pedophile ass. I want you to never hurt anybody again. This isn't a kidnapping, Lee. Then what is it? A rescue. I don't believe him. <laughs> I've been watching you for years. You better not fucking hurt her. I swear. I've been watching you for years. This is your best content. Thank you. Don't worry, pal. We'll get her back. Bro, I'm bit too. I'm so cooked. This like genuinely hurt my soul. What happened here to me? How's that feeling? Fine. Don't worry about it. It wasn't a full chomp. No, it wasn't. We don't have much time. Bro, what do you mean? It's Jover. We're about to have a lot less. We'll all make sure nothing gets in. You're still the smartest fucker out of all of us. Try to find another way out of here. I can't believe chat convinced me that it was Ben that like... What I did to Ben is the reason why What I did to Ben is the reason why I got bit That was fucked up Damn I was kind of hoping they dug some secret tunnels or something Like As though As though I'd be able to fucking get away without being bit If I hadn't done that to Ben There's thousands of dead filling the sewers And God only knows how many up top So, you know Hey We'll have time to chit chat later Just some surgical supplies. Maybe there's a hole in here. Hamas tunnels. Why aren't there any Hamas tunnels in this fucking hospital? We got to the one hospital where there's no Hamas tunnels, bro. This shit sucks. Think about that. I think it's some sort of spreading device. Grosses me out just looking at it. Think about how sick it would be. It's like a carjack. I don't want to imagine this being used on a body. Just take it, bro. You never know. You might use it. Fuck. See, if Hamas was here, we'd be able to get the fuck out of here with ease with the with the Hamas tunnels that we got. Is that a door? Well, can't touch that door. Hey, I think I found a way out. Bro, ain't no fucking way I'm gonna be able to get the elevator open. 
Uh, rib spreader being know. used here. I can't get my hands in between the doors. I'll have these doors open in two seconds. Damn, that's so easy. That rib spreader is powerful, bro. How is that even possible? Well, that's not a big enough hole for anybody to get through, in my opinion. Wait, what the hell's going on? Uh-oh. Am I turning into a zombo? I'm turning. I'm turning. I'm turning. I'm turning. I'm turning. Oh my god, I'm turning into a zombo. I would have chopped the hand off. Okay. This has to be done. Sorry, pal. I gotta do it. I'm awake! Stop! He's awake! He's still bitten! So? This is about trying to save him. At the very least, buy him some time. By chopping his arm off. Do we know it works? We don't know anything. We know there's gonna be a lot of blood. There's gonna be a shitload of blood. What I think dies? it would have been better if we chopped it then off the rest instantaneously. Of us go after and get the hell out of Savannah. Jesus. What are you guys talking about? We thought if we took off the bitten arm, you'd have a shot. I know it's drastic. You think? But what if it works? It's too it late. Might be the only way. It's too late, and what I would most think? likely die from the blood loss. No. We leave it. Are you sure? Yeah, I feel like I got time. Just keep an eye on me. I get my hands on the bastard who's got Clem. I'm gonna be happy to have them both. But you're gonna die. Yeah, but not in here. You guys keep an eye on that door. I'll work on getting us out of here. Lee? Oui. No. This is what we're doing, and I don't. Chat, stop saying bad ending unlocked. Okay. This is a blind playthrough. I don't know. I don't want to hear anything else, okay? Coward? I'm gonna kill myself at the end, chatters. The fuck do you mean, coward? I'd rather fucking suicide bomb the, the zombos and save Clementine and kill myself. Y'all are wrong for this. Bro, who's trying to spread the ribs this fucking hard? You know what I mean? I would have chopped it off on sight, not this late into the game. Here we go. We're gonna have to go as quiet as possible and see if we can make it to an empty floor or even the roof. Sounds good. Like I think chopping it off early on would have been uh, understandable, but at this stage, it's like it's too much of a risk. I'd rather have both arms and conduct my operations. Nice and quiet, everybody. And then kill myself at the end. There's some light up there. Good. Gotta get my ass off this ladder. Uh oh. Am I gonna ah! fucking uh oh? Am I gonna get lightheaded again and fall? Cause then that would suck. Oh, what's happening? I got booty cheeks up in my face. Watch out! Damn, that was fucking close. Everything okay up there? Oh, just fucking peachy. Good thing I said watch out. That really saved everybody. Uh oh, I'm getting lightheaded. Oh hell no. Oh hell no. Oh, hell no. Oh! Lee! Bruh. Lee! Oh, God. Bruh. Are you alive? Get up! Bruh. 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 Do I have the core? Do I have the core strength to be able to fucking prop myself back up? You have to pull yourself up. Jesus. Gotta get up. Uh-oh. 
God damn, he's got core. He's got core strength. He's demonstrated great core strength here. Good job. Almost as if you should have cut the arm off. Yeah, bro. One arm. This would be way better. You're right. I would definitely be able to get out of this one with one arm. What the hell is this? Oh, I guess that's not a window. It's just like straight open. I thought it was a window. It looked like a window with the with the effect. Is the first time I see someone not cut their arm? Yeah, because those people think that there's hope. I've given up. I'm being strategic. Many people probably Remember cut their Savannah arms off empty. thinking that they'll save themselves. Those Crawford bastards did one thing right, I guess. There must be thousands of them. They didn't follow us here, did they? It sure seems like it. That's crazy. They can't track. They just roam. Is it? That fucking train wasn't exactly discreet. Maybe we can wait for an opening. We could be waiting a long time. Still, Lee's right in that we gotta pick our time and go. Anybody know how far and in what direction the mansion is? We probably ought to start there. It's between us and River Street, so we can stop if we have to. Retrace our steps, maybe. And they get going towards the hotel where Clem's parents were staying. Okay. Look. Let's get our bearings and see if we can figure out a way to make it across town. Good? Good. I... Uh, don't think we can ignore what just happened to Lee. Just lost my footing, that's all. You gotta let us know if you start feeling funny, you know? I Bro, know. I'm not gonna fucking turn it's like just that. just dizziness, that's all. I'm all good. I'm not gonna turn without you figuring you out that be. I've turned, bro. Yeah. Chill. Good as I can be. Crazy. Now what? We get down and we find a little girl out there. Right, pal? I mean, I lied. I didn't just lose my footing. Uh, it was definitely let's the get our bearings. zomber virus, but still. Bro, I'm worried about Kennel, dude. Kennel is looking at me like he wants to throw the salt lake on my head now. You know what I mean? Not going back in there. Hospital must have run out of doctors. Some poor bastard took a spill. Yeah, looks like whoever was up here painting that sign went ass over tea kettle. What the hell does that even mean, brother? It's an extension ladder. You're his duck? No, he's gonna treat me like fucking Larry, bro. He's gonna... He's gonna get racially motivated that with looks it. looks like Crawford Square over there. Fuck that place. Did fix up our boat, though. We get Clementine and get right back. Make sure she wears her life jacket, okay? Something tells me she's not gonna want to. Penny and Lee are besties? Yeah, yeah but... Yeah, if half the dead population of Georgia wouldn't wander in the streets down there. See anything? Nah. I'm just, uh, I was taking a minute, actually. Sorry, I, I know I shouldn't. What's going on? That's just everything. Fuck, man. You know. I do. I can't thank you enough for what you did for Duck. I don't know how I'd be if you hadn't. Don't dwell on it. Wait, what do you I'm mean I killed him? I one-tapped him, bro. Right now. And I can't imagine Cat and Duck and all this mess. Kid. No. No, I'm sorry. We're in a fucking hurry to get off this roof. It's it's not the time. I'm sorry. I'm okay. There's a bell tower over there. We know what those do. Yeah. Could be part of how we get through the streets. Yeah. How many you think are wandering around underneath us right now? In the hospital? Thousands. I mean, who knows? It was full of dead before, right? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Can you almost left Lee die many occasions? I know. Dust. Kennel is not man, a good ally, knows? bro. Straight up. Straight up. Honestly. 
Any thoughts about anything else? Nah, I'm they're right. gay. I wish Just needed to take a second. I'll keep an eye out over here. Sorry. <sighs> Kenneled. There is a lot of sexual tension, though. Now that I killed his wife, or I mean, I didn't. She killed herself, but I didn't do anything to stop her. That's the church across the street from the mansion. River Street should be just beyond that. We need to head back that way. We'll stop off at the mansion, like you said, and make sure we didn't overlook anything. Yeah. I might have a way to clear us a path. I can make it to ben that bell tower. Killed his wife. I can draw the walkers down to that side of the hospital. There'll be thousands of them. That'll thin out the streets between here, the mansion, and River Street. Even if it's just for a few minutes. I've given up on the I, I've given up on the sexo run. I'm gonna be honest with you. Like the sexo run is over. The sexo run was over That's after the, the double sexo. The street from the mansion. River Street should be just beyond that. That was my turning point, honestly. When Anything I was like, yeah, here? I can't be fucking out here. Honestly, my vision isn't great. I think it's allergies or all that shit those walkers are kicking up. Allergies, shit. People used to get those. I know, right? You never see anybody in an end-of-the-world story with hay fever. It's not the time to get wistful. I know. It's this deal with Clem. It's everything. It's put this rage inside me like I can't even say. I used to get allergies, too, and just... Fuck. Who was that guy? Someone with priorities? Yeah, bro. Guess what? That's how we know allergies are fake, big dog. Okay? Ain't nobody's got allergies in the fucking end times. You want to know why? Ain't nobody's talking about like, oh, sorry, I have a gluten allergy. You know what I mean? Oh, my bad. Like, I can't be having this bread because I have a gluten allergy. Guess what, dude? No celiac disease at the end times, okay? That's how you know they're fake, brother. People are just making it up. Big Pharma made it up. People are doing it for attention. Got any good ideas for getting through that uh, herd? I'm working on it. Are you going to be able to hang in there? I have to. The mansion's that way. Yeah. If we can use that bell tower to bring them to that side of the hospital, it won't be an easy trip back toward River Street, but it wouldn't be impossible. I'm with you. Just have to get over there. I was thinking you and Omid wouldn't come with me. We look out for each other, but we sure as hell weren't going to let you go alone. Not with that time bomb chewed into your wrist. You two have been solid since day one. What's this? Day three? Four? Well, I appreciate it. It does feel like a lot more time has passed than fucking three days or four days, honestly. Especially since we met him. Anything back here? No. My goat. Goat what's mid. What's up over here? Bell tower. That's what's up. Huh, yeah, that could help. What up? Uh. Omid probably would be down for the sex zone. With the bell tower on this side of the hospital and the mansion over there, uh, that might be our way off this rooftop. I can make it to that bell tower. Turns out the I one I was going to sex was Omid all along, short king. There'll be thousands of them. That'll thin out the streets between here, the mansion, and River Street. Short King Fling, it's baby. Just for a few minutes. All right, all right, enough, enough. Come on. No way. It's higher than this roof for starters. Oh my God! I need the fucking okay, dude. Here, get the goddamn ladder. Get the gosh darn extension ladder. Put that shit on there. Let's freaking go, baby. <laughs> What cologne you think Omid wears? The worst one. The most aggro one. One hundo P. He's Persian, bro. Come on. I'm sorry, but our people are... The bells. We're bad with that. Yeah. Could buy us some time. Draw as many as we can this way. Get down off the roof on the opposite side and bust our asses getting back to the mansion. You think you should be the one to go? My leg's feeling better. Let me do it. See, if we have he's to the decide goat. who takes a risk like this, it should be the guy who's got the 
least to lose. Fucking Lee, come on, What's bro. Stop taking the L. I get bitten again? So we're agreed then. Bro. Let Goat Mead do some of the work. You know what I mean? Harry. That is an incredibly unsafe yeah. way to use the ladder. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't realize OSHA was in the fucking room, dude. Shit, my bad, bro. Is this an OSHA violation? Very unsafe, I know. Oh shit. Go fast, go fast, ah! go fast. Oh my god, am I stuck on the bell tower? That's crazy. Fuck? Well, it's Holy higher. Shit, I can jump man. down. Are you I can okay? jump back. Yeah, I'm fine. Try to find another way out of there? locked shit that's crazy the exit in here's locked that sucks by the way omid one hundo p would have died he ain't got the agility he ain't got the endurance remember he literally that boy literally fell off the train and took the fattest of l's like almost died to a leg injury he is not making it off that bell tower down to the hospital, okay? No shot. They're coming this way. And his Tons wife. Tons of them. Jesus. He saved his wife first. Now get yeah, back here. Pregante. Yes, chat. I saved his wife first because she is pregante. She's pregnant. I think I have to jump. There's no way back. Yeah, you can no make shit. it. It ain't that far. Oh, no. It's not that far. Just a little hop. Oh, my God. Oh, God. Kenny's going to be on the other side dropping my ass again. Dynamic jab. Thank you for the five gifted. Dude, Molly has saved my ass. Oh my god. Oh my god. Kenny didn't even try, bro. Good goddamn leap, pal. Let's get the hell off this roof. Kenny didn't even try. They just watched me. They just watched me fling my body, bro. These guys are so bad. I'm gonna eat them. Okay. I'm gonna save Clam and I'm gonna eat the rest, okay? That's it. I've made up my fucking mind, bro. No shot. <laughs> did more than you did for Ben? What? Dude, I've done so much for Ben. I almost picked him up. I tried Holy. to pick him up. Yeah, oh no, the bow got stolen. What the fuck? The least shocking turn of events. Bro, you left it open, Kenny. Kenny, you fucking left it open with the lights on, bitch. The fuck did you think was going to happen? I'm sorry. What did you think would occur? You left it open. I called it out, too, at the time. Come on. Just come the fuck on. Well, we're not coming back here after we find Clem. Who? Fuck. How could this happen? It's a guy on the radio. The one that's got Clem. They're gone. Holy shit, they're gone. Relax. Hello, Hosun. I'm your fan. Please read this. Thanks, Shatter. Hey, guys. No, it wasn't the guy on the radio. It was Vernon. What? No fucking way. The invalids? Their actions uh, contradict your character. Wow, that's ableist, bro. Chill. Kenny hit the old slur, dude. Station. But, yeah, the invalids. He's right. They're not invalids. They're just people. People who have been dealing with shitty situations even longer than we have. No wonder they got the jump on us. I don't give a fuck if their make-a-wish was a fucking boat ride! When I find them, I'm gonna rip their throats out! We would have done the same. Says the guy who wouldn't take a box of food from an abandoned car. Things have changed. 
He says he feels bad about leaving Clementine behind, but the boat was an opportunity they couldn't pass up. Vernon probably planned this out. That's pretty crazy. Eyes on that boat. They fuck. Bro, living under a hospital in secrecy, uh, stealing boats from children. Are they fucking Hamas or what, dude? Just. Yeah, this is the real Vernon was the real come ass all over along. The fence and let us into the backyard. We shouldn't be out in the open. Yeah. This is not happening. Everything is so fucked. Clementine is still out there. So we get Clementine and then what? We get the fuck out of cities. I'm done with cities. We go into the countryside and make a go of it. I don't want to go back out there again. Then don't go your own way. You're every man for himself until you and your boyfriend actually need something. You wouldn't have had a boat to lose without us. So shove it, okay? Everyone keep it together. Nothing has changed, has it? Nothing has changed? I mean immediately. We stay the course. Don't turn on each other. Bro, if without me, they're cooked, by the way. They're going to be fighting. We can do this in the yard. Actually, without me, they are so cooked. They, I give them like 10 minutes. What do we do now without a boat? Well, I, I know died. you two are just going to look out for number one and number two. You know, yourselves. It's not like that, man. Bullshit, it's not. Get to the countryside. We dicked around with cities and coastlines and boats too long. Take her out there. Live as safe as you can, okay? Yeah. We got to get out into some. Yeah, Kenny hates that. Kenny's like, no boats, I'm out. Kenny's like, I don't even give a fuck. Zombie apocalypse, no zombie apocalypse. Like, I just don't care. You know what I mean? What? The yard name dropped another fear and L? What is, what do you mean? Open spaces. You know that's what I'm for. This is bullshit. What does that mean? You might not even be around. So, with all due respect, Lee, his opinion doesn't carry a lot of weight. Hey, it's still his little girl out there. She's number one. That's the end of that, okay? But what about... Oh, shit! Here they come! In the house! Bro, close the fucking doors. What is happening? I chimed in with the haven't you people ever heard of. should be able to get into the backyard, right? Closing the goddamn Maybe door. Not. We can secure this place. Krista. Get on the windows in the front room. Check the boards. Got it. Kenny. Look for weapons. Gather anything you can find. Will do. Fuck, I should have What is it? Front doors! How is he fucking <sighs> capable of even getting this thing in? Like, Lee, I. Lee, help! Cut their I fucking arms off! There's gotta be a knife or something in there! Hurry! Bro, there ain't no knife in here. What are you talking about? There was never a knife in here. What? There's a casually Take a knife in here arms now? Off. When? When was now there what? a knife in there? Get ready to fight. This place seems dirty to me. I think we're fine. How is this possible, bro? Sturdy my ass! Get upstairs! Go! Why are there Oh wait, that was Brenda or Bree or whatever. Wasn't that literally Bree? Guys, help me with this! That was fucking Bree, wasn't it? Yeah. I, yeah, Little Miss Cancer, bro. Little Miss Cancer. Everyone get to the end of the hallway. This will slow him down. We get to the end of the hallway and take a fucking stamp. This is craziness. We can't let ourselves get trapped. Let's get as many as we can. When we see an opening, we go for it. Belinda. How many bullets y'all have? Three. Five. Oh, nice. Four. Y'all know where to aim. Get ready. Are they coming up here or what? What the fuck's going on? Oh, 
Oh my god, what are they aiming at, bro? They suck dick. I'm out, bro. I'm out. I'm out. I don't have any bullets left. I'm out. Me too. Fuck. Where do we go? There's no goddamn opening. No, I carried. Uh. Go. What the fuck was that red shit up there? Oh, I dropped the gun. No, they're gatted up now. The zombos got the gat. Son, we are that cooked. That could have gone better. Everyone okay? Lee's still bitten. Shut up. Okay. Let's get out of here and keep moving. Kid's right. We gotta keep moving. Think there's any chance we get Clem and catch up to those goddamn thieves? I don't know. Maybe. Well, we're not going out through this window. No latches, no- Someone just said Ben grabs the gun if you saved him. Honestly, if I had saved Ben there and he grabbed the gun, I would hope he would kill me, okay? Because I would rather fucking die than spend another moment with Ben, who probably would have caused the zombie apocalypse a, a second time. He probably would have been yelling loudly to get the zombies to follow the us into the house. And 30 feet straight down. Anyone have any ideas? I bet this guy would. He's got a resourceful air about him. Knock it off. Dixon Kent the Third, Industrial... Need Krista. Just trying to lighten the fucking tone. We need solutions, not stupid jokes. I'm sorry. So, no ideas then. There's gotta be another way. Check the floor for any other access, event, anything. Or we wait for the house to clear out and stick to the high ground. Whoa, Lee, you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm... I'm gonna have to just. Bro, I'm weak, dude. I'm weak as hell. Worst kidnapper of all time. Did you hear that? Yeah, I did. What did that mean? She's at the hotel where her parents were staying. He hasn't. How worst kidnapper of all time, bro? How do you let how do you let a six year old consistently grab control of the fucking walkie talkie? Mr. Jigsaw over here, absolutely just only good at kidnapping a six year old, so bad at continuously kidnapping the six year old. Moved her. Yet. Yeah. Yet. We need to start thinking about more than just Clementine when it comes to our urgency. What do you mean? How do we get out of here? That's the whole point. We don't know. Okay, now your life depends on it. How do you get out of here? I don't know. I don't get it. I do. We have to go now. Like right this goddamn minute. Where, Lee? Come on. We're trapped. How long you think we have? Or the window right there. Just I, jump out of it. I don't know. We should have cut it off. At least then there would have been a chance. Well, you didn't. And it's too late now. It was too I late think back we need then, to bro. have an adult conversation about what happens if Lee takes another spill. Hey, look. We could be looking at a Larry situation here. Who's Larry? It don't matter. I think it'd be best if we just worried about getting to Clem right now. We're not going to do her any good if you've attacked us. That isn't good. It's so funny. Dude, I, didn't I tell you? Kenny is like, Kenny's got a taste of blood, dude. Kenny is literally looking to Laryl to me so fucking fast. He doesn't even give a shit if I turn or not. He just wants the thrill of murder. I'm telling you, this is no good. What's gonna happen? How do you know that? Guys, I don't know what happened before Omid and I showed up, but we can cross this bridge when we get to it. Lee, I'm not advocating anything here, but how is this not a thing? We're all so worked up about Clementine that we're forgetting what the fuck happened to you. My arm is not the issue. I'm not the problem. The 500 walkers in the house and no door in this room are the goddamn problem. Yeah, maybe at the moment, but who's to say when it becomes an issue? At that point, there may not be any time left to deal with it. This is getting out of hand. You're gonna listen to me. We will get Clementine back, with or without you. Because I haven't given up everything to die because we were stupid. I'm sorry, okay? 
Fuck, we can't do this! We're gonna have to! Wait, what? Ah! What? You ruined that dude's face. Shut up, sweetie. Look. What? It's corroded to hell. What's on the other side of this wall? A 30-foot drop? No. This mansion butts up against the one next door. Bro. We are breaking out of here by this breaking the wall? Shit. Is this really possible? That's awesome. Kenny, I thought you were a handyman. I thought you would have known how to bust up a drywall or bust up walls like this. Yeah, we can do this. Okay. We'll work in shifts. Omid, Krista, and I. Lee, you rest. We have to work fast. Wow. I'm sorry. Me too. I get it. Go sit down. Damn. I wasn't intending on throwing it at him, was I? Why am I apologizing? I just found an exit, bro. Kenny's the one who almost cooked me. Got bitten. It would have been easy not to. Yeah. Well. He probably would have let you go alone if you hadn't told us, which would have been a mistake. If I were you, I would have been scared shitless. I was. The fucking thing, it, it happened so fast. You ever almost hit someone in a crosswalk? Almost? His license was suspended. Twice. Omid is my short king. He is so sick. Look at him. He's always got a smile on his face, dude. Smiling through it all. Just wham! Thing was on me. Never saw it. Like someone in your blind spot. Wish you would have taken it off. Don't think it matters much now. I'm losing a lot of feeling in it. Really? Yeah. It's hot, like when you break a bone. But tingly. Like it's asleep. <sighs> so when we get this guy, what do you think? We figure out who he is. And why he's doing this. We can rescue Clem, but she won't be safe if this guy's not gonna stop. So... Did your crew get into any shit before you met up with us? I do love that, like, Omid and the lady are not doing anything. Like, they're just... Kenny is, like, single-handedly trying to break this fucking wall while they're just sitting and yucking it up, dude. Yapping. Is it possible to have survived and not gotten into some shit? And, you know, whatever happens to you... Uh... <laughs> Seriously, can we not talk like that? The entire time we were at the hospital, I could sense you think you're as good as dead. I'm bitten, Krista. We all know that's a wrap. There's gotta be something. I wonder if Omi would say he's Persian. Wait, what? I no, I want to take her. Stop it. I'm serious. She'd be safe and relatively. No, honestly, to. honestly, she would be better. I think she'd be better than Kenny. I think she'd be better than Kenny. Bro, they're fucking... It's a two-parent household, chat. The fuck do you mean? She's already pregante. She got the maternal instincts. Two-parent household. Have you guys never listened to Ben Shapiro? We don't want a one-parent household, okay? If I left her with Kenny, Kenny would swap her for a boat. Kenny literally would walk up. As a Florida man, by the way, yeah, Florida man, already a big L. He would walk up to anyone with a boat and be like, you want a child slave? And would give her up for the fucking first boat that I'm he could get. This right now. Krista, listen to him. It's what I want, okay? All right, I'm out of gas. You look good and rested. Sure, if you don't count an infected leg. You want me to do it? Nah, and you can hop in after me. He did nothing, bro. That hole is Shouldn't ass. Shouldn't be long now. It's good we're forced to take a breath. I still can't believe you went and got chomped. Just fucking hell. At least he told us. Took some brass. I don't think I would've. How are you? I'm... Uh, 
I don't know how to answer that. I'm sorry. You've lost more than anyone. It'll be all right, kid. Why are you acting like what's happened ain't happened? Anyway, I appreciate it from both of you. A lot of us have lost families. Yeah, Kenny has also demonstrated that he doesn't know how to take care of a family, bro. He this already fucking killed his family. Been through? Bits and pieces. Before y'all, we had this woman, Lily, with us. Lord knows where she is now. Anyway, we had to make some tough calls with her dad. She came between Lee and I pretty good. And I spent a lot of nights hating this guy's guts. I'm sorry for hurting you in any way, Kenny. It's impossible to go through life without causing some sort of pain. And sometimes I can't help but wonder. I didn't realize we, we got the you and me both episode died. five was well, the gay episode. What the hell's geez. going on here? Talking about our fucking feelings and whatnot. Might as well get a little loosey goosey. She can't have a. She's fucking Pregante, bro. Oh! Fetal alcohol syndrome. All right. Bruh. Bruh. Fetal alcohol syndrome. That's another duck waiting to happen right there. Okay. That's another duck waiting to fucking happen, bro. She's about to give birth to another duck. Thank God Cle they can have Clementine now. She I'm just through. went. No walkers. Things are looking up. Omid is the goat, bro. Omid is so much stronger than Kenneth from Kenold. Everyone keep a goddamn eye out. This place seems pretty sealed off. Well. Oh, that's terrifying. That's so sad. <sighs> Smart. Think of all the people we've seen go. They got to do it their own way. Together. Don't you say that. You stick it out as long as you can. You do whatever you have to. I could have done more. You did everything you could. No, Lee. I could have been a better husband. Better father. Could have been a better friend. So let's figure out a way out of here. Get that little girl. We should move. Yeah. Got at least one shot left. Let's clear the room before we move on. Lee. Great time to say that a song by the wife who killed herself. Oh shit. I forgot. I forgot Katja took her own fucking life. But honestly, I mean, I was mad about her taking her own life from a purely selfish standpoint. Like I literally was thinking that it's fucked up because we need a vet. We need like a doctor in the team. You know what Figure I mean? Figure out where we're headed. Like, I didn't give a shit. I didn't give a shit about Wait. her, like, pain okay? and sadness. Yeah. Let's keep at it. Bro, that's why I'm... F Brother, that was the team healer, okay? That's why I'm fucking community leader. I guess Crawford would have gotten them anyway. I'm literally making the right choices you guys are not willing to make. Like, I'm willing to make the tough choices that you guys don't want to make. Hundreds of them. Judging by the decor of this room, I guess they were PBS watchers. Hey, my parents' house looked a lot like this. And they watch kung fu movies. Just saying. Hard to believe the world once felt this peaceful.
What do you call this thing? Art? Good one, Omid. It's sick, but think of all the pain they avoided. Like once you made an active decision, I guess Crawford would have gotten them anyway. I feel like once you made an active decision to Don't survive, Don't ask me how different. I'm doing. Let's just keep going. Might be the way out. Talk to Kenny five or six times for an Easter egg. It's sick, but think of all the pain they avoided. Really? Don't ask me how I'm doing. Let's just keep going. Is Don't ask me how I'm doing. Let's just keep going. Don't ask me how I'm doing. Let's just keep going. Randy oh. Tudor. Good man. Damn fine man. Powerful stash. One of the greats. What? House is full too. Stay quiet. What the fuck was that? Randy Tudor is a developer at Telltale. Damn, Nothing self insert. Other than personal items in here. Looks like we can stay off the streets all the way to River Street if we're careful. Let's go. A dev's ego jizzed on you? Dude, whatever, dude. I'll, I'll fucking... I'll get jizzed on by the dev. Oh, here we go. Another parkour mission. Dude, I'm... I'm so good at parkour. Oh, meat is definitely not making it through. Oh, shit. Oh shit. Kennel Kennel is not making it through. One of them's gotta fall, bro. Let's keep going. Be careful nope. up here. They haven't learned to climb yet, right? Ben would have fell here if you saved him. It's good to be moving. You're doing good. I'm not, but I'm trying, man. What happened? Honestly, you know how many nights Fuck, Cat and I laid in that broke down RV, and she'd give me hell for not thinking enough about the rest of you. All of them, every damn night. You got that walkie-talkie? Yeah, of course I do. You might want to give him a call and tell him we're coming for him. Yeah, right. Yo. Be careful, cross here. Ben Joyers, dude. Ben Joyers are delusional, dude. Why? Why am I looking down, bro? Come on. I hate this. Don't look down. River Street's just up ahead. Ben nope. had the cure? No, he Mom, didn't. Darkness full of walkers? Fuck that shit. I don't see any down there. Bro, I swear to God, Ben would have the cure to, to, to the zomber virus in his hand and he'd break the fucking vial. And be like, oh, don't get mad at me, man. I did the best I could. Like, that's what he would do. I swear to God. He'd be like, oh, I found the cure. Psh, break it. I'm serious. He fucking sucks. You can hear him, right? We're all desensitized to it, but I can still smell them. Let's keep going, you bunch of lollygaggers. <clears throat> oh, fuck. <sighs> well? I'm so sorry. We have to get it back. That's our lifeline to her. 
But we can find this guy without it. And what if we don't? We need every clue that comes out of it. Lee's right. I am so fucking sorry. It's fine. We just need to figure out who's going down there. Ben is a no, kick watcher, one hundo p. Krista. Oh, Jesus we let the Pregante go in. I got it. Get me up. Fuck. We can't reach. Find something fast. Fast would be good. Keep a fucking eye on her. That thing? Nope. Would that work? Grab onto this. We'll pull you up. Good. Thanks. Oh my god, I'm so strong, bro. I'm so oh, fuck. Uh oh. 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 Zumbo. Zum. Zambonis? Oh no. Oh Shit, no. Shit, they're in there! Oh no, it's the Zomber special, bro. It's the Zomber special. Fuck! Jump up here, baby! Let's go! Jump! <sighs> bro, hold fucking Me one of the. Fucking mouth. Ken, <sighs> what are you doing? Get her, Ken! Can't you said all that shit and not do something now? Come on, reach! <sighs> I got you, hun! Save her! Go, go, go! Can you fucking hear me? Oh no. Oh no, what the fuck's Kendall doing? What is Kendall doing, bro? Oh my god, it's <sighs> Kenneth Copeland. Oh my god, it's Kenneth Get Copeland. Kenny. Where are you? <sighs> Kenaldo! There ain't no way. There ain't no way, bro. There ain't no way he RIP'd Get the himself. Get off me! He's RIPing himself. No! We can't go no. after him. Where? Where'd he go? He's dead. Maybe he's not. He went down there for you. I know he did. He... Bro, that's crazy. Ken Aldino, that's crazy. Ken Aldo, he did it. He did the damn thing. Cristiano Canaldo, number one. Yeah, I bet there's boats in heaven, chat. Marshall Hotel is around the corner of the block. Are you okay? Do you want to talk? Kenny was my friend. Soon as someone dies, they don't immediately have to have their sins forgiven. Well, it gets an hour moratorium at least. I understand. This is a shitty time, but I want to make sure we're clear before we go forward. What is it? Now with Kenny gone means I don't know if I don't know if Kenny actually died, bro. There was like a very unceremonious death almost. Also, Krista is chirping, dude. I can't believe he she chirps like this when like Canaldo literally went down there and and sacrificed his life to save her Pregante ass and she's still like, "Eh, well they all have sins." It's because she's like a radical Maoist. And she's like, he's a white man. And therefore, he's an America KKK uh, colonizer. She doesn't Omid care. And I have to stay safe for her. You guys would be great for her. Keep her safe. We do our best. You know that. Are you okay? I should be asking you that. You know what I'm talking about. It's nothing. Kenny didn't die for her. It's nothing. Let's just keep moving. 
have to cross here. Well, at least it doesn't look like a death trap. Is Omid a Shaw supporter? We don't know if he's like a Mossadegh guy. Who's going first? You're the lightest. He's got a busted leg and you're walking for two. I'm obviously not doing so hot. Decision what do you mean you're walking for two? I'll go first, in case anything happens out there. You sure? Yeah. We know she's Pergante. I know she's Pergante. I'm just shocked that he knows. And he didn't fucking stop her from guzzling that whiskey. Also, that baby resettled in that booty when she fucking fell on her ass like that. I'm gonna be honest. There's no baby no more at that point. Just go nice and slow. That baby coming out, not right. She's doing her very best to fucking abort the fetus. She's doing pro-choice shit, bro. She is not doing pro-life shit. She is doing aborto. Okay. Almost there. It's an easy crossing. Good. Yeah, yeah. So easy, bro. For sure. You spoke too soon, big guy. Oh, my God. Shit! Oh, fuck. Shit. Are you okay? Fine. I'm kind of fucked here. What are you going to do? I'll figure something out. There's not a ton of options. What do you mean, bro? Can you help me? I don't know what we can do from here. Anything. It's fucked, Lee. Fuck it. I'm going for it. Wait, going why didn't you just cross? What does that mean? It means I'm already bitten. I just have to push my way through. What the fuck? Find me when you get down. What the fuck does that mean? It means what it sounds like. Hotels around the corner. Find Clementine and me as soon as you can. You're crazy! There's no other way. Yeah, what do you mean he's going for it? What does that even mean? He's just going to jump down? That's crazy. Maybe they won't bite me because I'm already a zombo, right? They don't bite one another. What if we figure out that zombos don't bite other zomb they don't bite one another i'm one of them bro zamboni bro that makes no dang sense That, why would they hit me? Why would they hit me? It makes no dang sense to hit me, bro. Bro, these zombos got nothing on me, son. God damn, I'm just cooking their asses, bro. They lame as hell. They fucking slow as hell. But I swear, they're not even coming after me. Because... They're not really coming after me at all, honestly. They're barely coming after me. Maybe I'm wrong. I mean, I, I'm sure they'll fucking cook my... Ooh. Oh my god, clean slice? Let's fucking go, baby. They're not that aggro. They're not as aggro as they would be if I was a human. Wait, the car? Oh my God, it's the car. It's the car you stole from? Excuse me. No, I didn't steal from them. Me and, me and Clementine didn't steal from the fucking car. Everybody else did. That's crazy, bro. I never, I never stole in this game, okay? I never would advocate for stealing, especially not at the top of the hour.
when there's a three minute ad break, I would advocate for you to subscribe the legal way.